Welcome to Field of Glory 2. We're playing the Alexander the Great uh, 15 stage campaign. We'll see how far we go. Uh, we're playing this on, <clears throat> I think it's on the second highest level. Not quite deity. I think it's it's close to the highest level, but it isn't. I don't know if that matters in a campaign game that is created by the by an individual. So we're gonna fight a 15 battle historical campaign of Alexander the Great. I'm looking really looking forward to this. Haven't played um, Field of Glory two in a while, so looking forward to playing a little series here, having a little bit of fun with it, playing Alexander. Let's see how far we can go as Alexander. Uh, the first battle is going to be a battle against the Thracians, um, and in this particular battle, um, he Alexander the Great had to fight um, a large force of force of Thracians who are defending a pass on the uh, on the slower slopes of the Hamus Mountains. They blocked the pass with wagons loaded with rocks, which they rolled down on Alexander's army. So we're going to get this battle started. We're fighting in mountain passes, so not the best place for. Phalanx infantry broken ground generally not a good place for phalanx infantry in my humble opinion So let's see what the terrain looks like in the battlefield I am looking forward to this battle. I, I'm a big fan of um, the Macedonians and in, in particular Alexander so Okay, well, I can't see much of the terrain yet um, the battle objectives are typical if you Route 40% of the enemy troops and have a 25% difference you win. There are 24 turns in the camp in the battle uh, The enemy are offering open battle. Okay, good And here's our terrain. Let's kind of take a look at this. We don't have much of a core force down here <laughs> Okay But we do have 753 points. So what am I gonna do here? Well Veteran pike phalanx Hmm. Let's get this javelin horse. Uh, they have javelins. Mm, those are 30. This isn't really great cavalry ground. Use the Thracians against themselves. Hmm. I do like that option. We're going to definitely want big fan of the skirmishing club. So light infantry better in, in my opinion, in mountain terrain, you would think. Um, you know, we've got a lot of light troops. We've got about 300. Hmm. To go with this pike infantry. So 307 for a boy. Medium foot. So 181. Citizen hoplites. These guys are average. Hmm. Go with two pike phalanxes. Let's see what I've got in this. I mean, I'd like still like having cavalry. Um, veteran. Hmm. Take one more of those. That leaves me with thirty-one. Is there another thirty unit anywhere? Anybody? Bueller. Hmm. Somebody's got a 31. Now I can do this. It gets me to 55. Uh, 
really doesn't do me any good. Get rid of, nope, nope. I don't wanna do that. Hmm. Could do this, what do I got, 73? 37 left. Uh uh. Can't do that. So I got 73. Yep. There we go. Good deal. And we will auto deploy. Right. Well, I don't really like this. How far forward can I get these guys? Okay, they already are as forward as they can be. Um, and these are Thracians, Thurifoy. I don't know how well they do on broken ground. This looks like broken ground. Hmm. Well, I think what we're going to do is my plan. No. Is to load veteran Thracians. I like that, like an exploitation unit. Thurifoy are medium foot. We've got these heavy foot right in the middle. Nice. And kind of Thracians, veteran Thracians, Thracians. Okay. Veterans here. I've got these light skirmish cavalry. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to try to advance my infantry and meet the enemy in battle here. Hopefully he'll come out and meet me in this open space that is favorable to my forces. Meanwhile, I'm going to take these troops and deploy them um, on this high ground here. Yeah, this is this is good high ground here. So, what do we got here? We got slingers, javelin men. We're gonna want these javelin men like here, maybe these slingers here to, these slingers up in here so they can just cause havoc with the enemy. Hmm. Swing out these lights. These guys are going to go over here. Kind of a light infantry. And I want that gap there, so. And we're going to do this with these guys. Okay, so here's. Our objective, I want to get these slingers in a position over here and here where they can kind of shoot down into the enemy. Maybe up in this little position. Move these guys here into a blocking position. Move my main infantry force here, right about here, to offer battle. Um, my cavalry is going to deploy over here and hopefully be able to hammer into the enemy flank. So basically, anvil, infantry anvil force, hammer with the cavalry, not a very big potent hammer, and then harass, this. I've got a very large light infantry contingent that should be able to deal with the enemy lights. And what we wanna do is we wanna trip them. We wanna trip them badly until we engage. So, all right, let's do this, I'm ready. I've already deployed them, except. You can add two more generals, okay. Well, where's Alexander? Is that Alexander? That is Calius. That's gotta be Alexander. No, okay. Hmm, two more commanders. Well, I want a commander of this light cavalry unit here. And... That'll do it. Yeah, we'll just continue with deployment. All right, here they come. 
All right, so it looks like we've got more lights than our opponent. take that position. Maybe we will end up having to drive them off that hill. The nice thing I like about this so far is that we are in a good position to just really Establish kind of some sort of dominance. Whoa, that thing is driving me crazy. Hang on. Guess I'm gonna get rid of that. I got a slim cleaner. I use slim cleaner as one of my um, tools. I really like it as far as cleaning up my desktop. If you have a better solution, I will use. But um, I've been using that, and then I use a driver, uh, some some cleaner version that seeks out and finds, you know, where your drivers are not updated. But the problem is it interrupts me, like just like that, all the time. Uh, let's see if we can move that back. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna shift to the right a little bit here. Let's see if we can straighten them up. We can. That's good. get this this infantry out of this rough so I'd like to get the, the main army like right across here the cavalry over here to hammer into them what are we dealing with here we're dealing with Thracian infantry they're average wow it's a big army though we have this huge group over here so you know we've got they're hammering into us over here but this ground is going to take a while to get over so we can kind of press them this way Let's see how it goes. All right. Confirm. First blood to the enemy. I don't know who they're okay that's their Sutez is their commander-in-chief and this guy over here is poorly armed rebel I like that Start with these troops over here. That's a really bad start. Full arc on him. Deal. Should cause a morale check. No. Nope. Oh, 
those guys out there. Oh, oh, we're gonna do this. So far, not so good. There you go. They will hold their position. So, yeah, we've got the right hammer hitting here. But it's not working out very well so far. We do have this unit that's kind of broken off here. I see a nice juicy target right there. I want these guys to come off there. This is... Oh, Boise. Oh, that was deadly. Try to force um, focus fire on those guys. These guys, I don't think these guys are going to be that easy to dislodge, even with heavier infantry attacking up the hill, but we'll find out. Trying not to do what Alexander the Great never did, which was lose. <laughs> My first battle as Alexander. All right. Hmm. Does that flank help? Okay, it does. Good. There we go. They will flee, they will flee. These guys closer in. There we go, get our heavies back there. Oh, yeah. He might be able to attack into these guys. We'll see. Hmm, this is interesting. I'm not gonna focus on all these guys here. Oof. There we go. That's a great start. Let's crash into these guys here. And they go running away. First break to the Macedonians. these guys here Let me get these would love to get these guys to pull through that rank there and withdraw
unfortunately, these guys are going to take a beating. And they've already lost almost 100 men. wait that's the problem I think I've got to I've got to exploit what I can exploit and do it now I put Alexander in a really rough spot quick um who hasn't done anything okay i'm gonna leave them right where they are okay in turn confirm This is getting really interesting. He's out flanking this, these guys here. Pulling back his... That was interesting because now those, those poor souls actually have a fighting chance over here. There we go, break. Rally, that's good. Good for us. These guys even turned their back. That's. Oh, they didn't. Okay. Hmm. All right, so these guys are chasing these guys. Okay, so that's not going to do anything there. Not already in combat, so no cohesion drop. There we go. Go to odds. Odds. Definitely bad for the. The bad guys. What am I going to do with this? Uh, let's try before I do that, let's try to. Armored Lancers. These guys are Cavalry Armored Light Spear. Hmm. Yep. Nope.
Let's just cause chaos. Second. They're on the crest, so they're on the uh Fighting that rough. Yeah, that looks that looks like the end of that turn. Oh boy. They blocked my uh, phalanx from getting at these guys, which is a bummer because medium versus medium, it's kind of a wash that battle. That and these guys are just ignoring these skirmishers up here because this they they become focused on that. Oh man, this is crazy. This battle is. A lot of fun, a lot of fun. <sighs> okay, so they're not already in combat. They are now. I'd love to I'd love to charge into these guys, but there'll be time enough for them. Frontal assault. Oh my. Okay, I am just thinking about being this rabble, and then you um, realize that you've got veteran heavy cavalry <laughs> charging at you, and you're like the junior varsity squad of the Thracian army. Yeah. Can't engage these guys. Okay. Hmm. Eighty-two. There we go. Oh boy. This 
is not what I would refer to as ideal. These guys are nearly out of ammo. Let's see what we've forgotten. Take that. Yeah, now we're at an advantage here, but I'm, I'm gonna let my like to let these skirmishers have one more round with them. You know, no, let's let's get to winning this battle. There we go. Smart move. Good. There we go. Okay, it's gonna. We got 18 turns left, and so far, the right, the left flank of the Thracians is getting just completely enveloped. Hey, I don't have any cavalry on my left flank at all. I just put it all on the right. They're just flowing through here like a river. Question is, can this this sizable force here have an effect before it's too late? to oh my goodness yeah there they were goners part of the problem now is being able to wield off the army Ooh, enemy chariots. Didn't even see them. Fantastic. Oh, bummer. And this bowl was just about out of ammo, so the timing is good. And they killed 48 more. And then these guys. I should have fixed them with Alexander if I could. Yeah, that was a mistake. regular foot nope the only job that guy has up here is to just be a distraction Ooh. This is their last real good round of just devastating. We're going to be short on ammo after this round. How many casualties are these guys taking here? Almost 200. Actually, over 210. Yeah, I think that's going to do it for this turn. I'm 
Oh, maybe not. We got these guys yet. Oh, his command element has rallied over here. Oh, that's a different unit. Hidden. Oh, boy. Enemy medium infantry. They finally they finally dispersed our defense up here in this hill. Now it's gonna get dicey. We gotta crash into them, crash into them. lights and open against heavies it's a slaughter it's just a slaughter hmm these guys are gonna break regardless so yep there we go that's exactly what I want to do Just hitting these heavies through the rough. Come on, Alexander. Plow through them, boys. Oh, just getting massacred. Sounds great. Hmm. I've got to leave this cavalry here to protect against, um, quickly right, let's see what we can do with these guys here oh. okay they have plenty of ammo left so why not my goal is to destroy these guys before before the enemy um, these guys even are a factor let's take a look at those pretty sweet looking scythe chariot look at the scythes coming out of it pretty cool all right we gotta fight these little just gotta hold Ooh. These guys are probably better in the rough than my guys. Hmm. Yeah, I don't think I can. Um, I think I got to pull back. And these guys, yeah, they got to pull back. And these guys can turn around and just keep out. These guys look like these guys look like. Velites, they're Thracian Peltests, but they do look a lot like 
Hmm. I am half tempted to do that. They still. That's awesome. These guys are really taking some. Oh, 250 men down. One in every four men. I mean, imagine this. These guys have not seen any combat, and one out of every four men around them has fallen with an arrow, a rock. I mean, they're just getting beat up. The enemy uh, left flank is in big trouble. And they're already at 30% losses. Don't get Alexander killed. Don't get Alexander killed. Oh, here comes the attack. Yep. They're not going to be a factor, I don't think, at all. Whew. Yeah, we're in trouble on our own flank now. these guys off relatively quickly going to do any damage but they're going to get in their way so they can't do any damage yeah i'm not going to beat these guys but what i am going to do That's basically just a harassment technique. Off the run. There we go. Okay, they're not already in contact. Well, they are now. I suspect they're. Yeah. Oh boy. Whew. Just hold on, boys. These guys fight it out at the end of the turn because I suspect they are not going to survive that fight. Boy, those guys. NVP maybe? I don't know. Pretty close to it. Still got these guys here. Hmm. Might it. Might they hold out another turn if I... Yeah, they're not going to. Need to accept that fact. And end the turn. They will fight before. It 
dispersing is great. Yeah, they're they're done. Hold boys, nope. Yeah, and that's his command unit disrupted, and they break, and now they're over. They're over the border. I think that's gonna do it. Yeah, nice. And so ends the first battle of the fifteen battles. Hopefully, hopefully fought fifteen battles of Alexander Great campaign historical part two. That was a blast. Um, let's take a look. Ooh, I got an achievement too. Sweet. Yeah, one of the things was they added achievements to this game, and I haven't played it for a while, and now I'm starting to get achievements, so that's cool. Let's take a look at the casualties. So, the enemy brought to the field um, 27,000 troops, and they lost 12,570. They're killed. Lost 2198 killed. We lost 1874 troops, they lost 12,570. A lot of them deserted, ran. But that's what happens in ancient warfare. So big victory for Alexander. Let's take a look at what our next round is. Successfully achieved the victory conditions for the previous stage of the campaign. The Macedonian army lost 10%. The Thracian army lost 45%. Somehow Alexander's infantry dodged the wagons, the Thracians threw down their weapons and ran away, leaving behind their baggage and women. The Triballi were up to their usual tricks, so next Alexander north marched north and met them in battle with 20,000 to 30,000 men at the Ligonus River, not far from the Dan Danube. Alexander caught them pitching camp. Engage them now before reinforcements can arrive. You must detach some of your units from the field as garrisons. Well, let's do, do that first. Hmm, it says two garrisons, zero. So. Hmm. Oh, between 10 and 483 points of troops as garrisons. Well, let's do this. There, I kicked an archer into the garrison. Yep, I am. Engage them now before reinforcements can arise. Yes. Let's take a look at the deployment. Macedonian versus Triballi Thracian. I have 19 points, but nothing worth 19. Um, so that's that. Same, basically, the same things as before. A little more open field. Oh, we got a river here. Enemy front line. Enemy front line. Hmm. OK. 
cavalry there. Yep, I actually like this deployment. Mm, the only thing I don't like is the skirmishing deployment. And there we go. There we go. I like it a little bit better here. There we go. And we'll leave it at that. Two more generals. Well, I've got one here. Let's add a general to the skirmishing troops. And I'll add a general to these lights over here. all righty might as well play the second round Whew. yeah I think what we're gonna do is end this scenario here and then I will come back for episode number two of the second battle in the Alexander campaign the second battle on the Battle of the Ligonus fighting the Thracians again we look like we have to cross a little stream here. All right, see you next episode.